A Tampa woman is giving new meaning to the term runaway bride. Her fiancé called off the wedding just a week before they were supposed to be married. But she turned that rejection around and ran off in a race with her friends supporting her. Now, this is a touching story here, really of resilience. Yes, it is. Fox 13's Evan Lambert joins us now to explain why this woman is actually thanking <laughs> the man she was supposed to marry. Thanking him. That's great. Mark Kelly, there's no way to sugarcoat how Kylie Manulock first felt. She says she was in a deep despair, but all that changed when she decided it was time to take control of her situation. It was something like, um, you know, I can't do this. Um, I'm, I'm done, and I don't want to marry you. They're the words any bride has nightmares about. For Kylie Manulock, it was even worse. Coming from her fiancé in a text message a week before the wedding she'd planned for two years. And it was really devastating. It, it was really heartbreaking. Kylie says she could hardly move for a week, but instead of letting her heartbreak win, she chose to run with a crazy idea proposed by one of her bridesmaids. I'm like, let's trash the dress. Let's do something just to at least, like have fun with it. Last weekend, Kylie and her bridal party put on their dresses and did a color run, a race where runners end up covered in bright colored powder. I said, I'm going to do it in my wedding dress. The whole time, supported by other runners and her best friends. The group even got called up on stage where Kylie relived her story, but now it had a positive twist. I did it for me. I did it to help me heal. Um, I did it to, you know, kind of show other people, like, it's okay, you know, everything happens for a reason, you know, push through it. As for the dress, well, it was no longer white. It was fun. I mean, it looked very colorful. It looked different. It looked, um, and like I said, it, it now represented something different and it, it represented something better. And Kylie wasn't going to let her ex-fiance make the rest of her life anything but bright. I thank him, you know, for saving me, you know, for heartache and heartbreak and for letting me go so that I can find, you know, happiness and love and true love. Kylie says she plans on getting the dress dry cleaned and donating it the, or the proceeds to charity. Mark and Kelly. I'm sure she is. That's, that sounds perfect. Good for her Very and having well that attitude because that's all you really can do. And her friends all supporting her, which is huge. That's yeah. true. And, and that's, that's a, you know, when you get put in the position like that, when you feel like your world's crumbled around you, nobody can make you feel like that but yourself. Yep. Right. So she's clearly turned around and said, I'm not going to be has, the emotional be victim. Great. So, yeah. Good for her.